हेलो फ्रेंड्स दिस इज डॉक्टर के यू नाइक हेयर एंड टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू डिक्लेयर वेरिएबल्स इन पाइथन एंड हाउ टू आइडेंटिफाई डेटा टाइप ऑफ दोज वेरिएबल वी विल यूज जुपिटर नोटबुक फॉर कोडिंग पर्पस एंड यू कैन सी लाइन नंबर एल एन फॉलोड बाय एम टी ब्रैकेट एट द टॉप लेफ्ट हैंड कॉर्नर एंड देन the empty bracket is followed by blinking cursor which indicates that we can start typing our commands from here so let us start by declaring a comment in python press shift key hold it and then press hash key and then type declaring variables and assigning values to them so when we are issuing hash shine python automatically understand that it is a command and python will not execute this line now what is comment a comment in python is a description of code or outcome of a program always starts with hash symbol now let us declare variable 1 where underscore 1 is equal to 5 then variable 2 is equal to 5.5 then variable 3 is equal to into inverted comma true and then variable uh, 4 is equal to into bracket machine learning so now you can see that in variable 1 we have stored 5 in 2 we have stored 5.5 and in 3 we have stored a true uh if you look at the first variable value 5 is stored into it which is integer 5.5 is floating point numbers true or false is a boolean kind of data and machine learning is a text or string information now you can see that the empty bracket is empty but if you will execute this code then number 1 will appear over there let us try it first of all press control a and then press shift enter and your code will be executed and you can see the result ne the empty bracket is now filled up with the value 1 which indicates that your code has been successfully executed by python interpreter now let us try to print the values which are stored in this variable so again press shift and hash key and uh, type a comment displaying values stored into memory very bells variables so print method we can use in python type print into bracket into inverted comma the value stored in variable number 1 is equal to uh, then simple comma and variable name okay now go to at the go at the end of the bracket and press shift enter and you can see that the python has print printed out the value stored in variable number 1 is equal to 5 if you want to know the data type of this variable then you can use type method type variable uh, variable 1 go at the end of the uh, bracket and then press shift enter and python has written the output called integer it means in variable number 1 we have stored value 5 which has data type of integer now you can practice for variable number 2 3 and 4 and python is case sensitive language uh, you can see that variable 1 v is capital variable 2 v is capital but in variable 3 and 4 v is not capital so take care of the case sensitivity of uh,
coding and then accordingly execute your commands for rest of the three variables thank you participants thanks a lot like my video share it and subscribe my channel bye bye